Well, good morning, YouTube. Madam Roy back again. Back to you with another one of these pickup videos. I have a combination of things I got at Dollar Tree and at the thrift store today. Got to go through quite a bit here, so let's go ahead and get started. Firstly, from the Dollar Store, I picked up two packs of these Whiskas Temptations. These are the Tasty Chicken flavor. Uh, 48 grams or 1.7 ounces each. Um, these actually boast that they um, help control tartar, which my big cat needs, and he absolutely loves these. Uh, there's the nutrition information for those of you that are interested. And yeah, got those for a dollar a piece. Next, I picked up a few bags of this Pop Kernels Yellow Gourmet Popping Corn. These I use with my uh, air popper. This is a 16 ounce, 454 gram bag. Um, says no GMO and a gluten free food. And I must say, these are delicious. Um, again, here are the nutrition facts for those of you that are interested. Um, these are actually made in, by Pop Kernels in Bellevue, Nebraska. And I picked up uh, two or three bags of those. Next, I picked up a few more of these uh, beer nuts. I've done this in the past, so I won't talk too much about them, but definitely an excellent snack for night. They have the uh, skin still on them, and they're also they're sweet and salty at the same time. So, again, something I really love to eat at night. Picked up a few more of these pillar candles. Um, this is the only new scent that I got. This is the fresh linen, and this is absolutely fantastic. I uh, burned this all last night, and it really gives a uh, calming effect. Plus, I also picked up a few more of the um, apple cinnamon and another one of these fresh linens. So, in total, I picked up four of these, and this one, of course, is the uh, black cherry. So, that's it for that bag. Come on over here, and I'll show you what else I got from the Dollar Tree. I picked up a package of these cobblestone English muffins. This is a six pack for a dollar. Again, excellent value. Now, bear in mind if you do buy bread from the dollar store, it's usually right at the end of its uh, Best Buy date. So make sure you go ahead and put those right in the fridge. And I'm going to go ahead and do that as we speak. That way it'll stay fresh for a while. And as you can see, we are definitely fully stocked up on bread right now. And the two last things I picked up at Dollar Tree are these TJ Farm Select Frozen Vegetables. This is uh, cut corn. And this is a 14 ounce bag or 397 grams. And once again, you guys can pause the video if you want to read the nutrition facts. And I also picked up a bag of peas and carrots. Once again, uh, same size as the corn. And once again, there are the nutrition facts for those of you guys that are interested. That's for the Dollar Tree goodies. Now I'm going to move on to what I found at the thrift store today. All right, and I found quite a few goodies at the thrift store. As you guys know by now, this is sale day at my local thrift store. Everything is 25% off. So the price you see on here, I got them for 25% less. Firstly, for $2.98, of course, minus the 25%, I picked up a humongous pack of the self-stick notepads. These are the Office Max uh, generic for post-its. They seem to work just fine, and we use these for leaving notes for every for everybody around the house and many other uses, so that should last us a good long while. Next, I picked up the widescreen Scary Movie 4 unrated and uncensored edition. I got that, again, for $0.56 cents minus the 25%. Very, very funny movie. I highly recommend seeing it. I, I love pretty much every movie in the Scary Movie franchise except for the last one. Best not talk about that. That was pretty much a total disaster. And the disc itself is in very good shape. No major scratches or anything. And uh, I'm not going to pull every disc out of these, but I just want to show you that they do tend to get good quality DVDs and CDs at that thrift store. Next, we have Fun with Dick and Jane. This one was 98 cents, again, minus the discount. And a very, very funny movie. I actually own this movie, but the DVD that I have, the beginning is, uh, does not play properly. I actually have to forward to the second chapter, which is about... 15 minutes into the movie for it to play, so it'll be nice to have a copy that I'm pretty sure is going to work flawlessly. 
And next, I have quite a few CDs here. So, first one I picked up for 98 cents is actually a video game. And let me go ahead and turn the light off here so you guys can see this a little bit better. This is Law & Order, Dead on the Money, a uh, game for the PC. It says it runs on Windows 95, 98, uh, 2000, and XP. So you can see this is the original Law & Order because there's Jerry Orbach right there. And I'll probably do a, a, a gameplay video of this once I actually install it and uh, figure out how to use it. But very interesting two CD set for uh, 98 cents. I have the Morning Star Worship um, with Leonard Jones and Matthew Donovan. Looked kind of interesting. I figured for the price it was worth picking up. Then I have two, uh, Disc 1 and Disc 2 of the Hits of the 80s. We got some really good songs on there. Uh, let's see what we got. Bringing Down the House, Everybody Wants to Rule the World, Karma Chameleon. And the second disc set has Flash Dance, uh, Heaven is a Place on Earth, Higher Love, uh, Material Girl, just to name a few. And again, excellent songs and a really good deal on those. Then I picked up uh, He Reigns Newsboys, uh, the Worship Collection. I have, do not actually own any of their worship music. I have their basic pop singing, but none of their worship. So this will be kind of interesting to uh, listen to. Again, excellent condition and a very good price on those. Picked up this uh, Praise Worship, uh, Glorify Thy Name. Um, this is from Hosanna Music. Um, I have a lot, a lot of their old cassettes from the 80s, but very few of their CDs. And uh, they got some really good songs on there. He is Exalted, You Are Crowned with Many Crowns. Um, we used to sing both of those songs in, on, in our church choir. Um, let's see what we got here. Victory Song, Let God Arise. So, yeah, excellent. I am so happy to have this. And this is probably my favorite uh, CD I purchased of the day. Alvin and the Chipmunks, Chipwrecked. I actually do not own this soundtrack. I have the soundtrack from all the other movies, except, of course, for Road Chip, because that one has not been released yet. Got this for 98 cents. And with the exception of a little crack in the case there... The disc itself is in phenomenal shape. Well, I guess it does have a few cracks on the back, but not to worry. I'll go ahead and replace this case. But the most important part, the CD itself, as you can see, is basically flawless. There are no scratches at all. <laughs> and I just noticed the picture of Alvin on a hang glider. That's pretty cool. Getting down to the wire, the very last CD I bought is... The soundtrack to the 1986 movie Little Shop of Horrors. Again, I'm sure a lot of you guys have seen this movie, but for those of you that haven't, an absolutely fantastic uh, musical from the mid-80s. Starring Rick Moranis, Ellen Green, Steve Martin, and Vincent Gardenia. Um, basically, it's about a... I'm not going to give the spoilers out. Basically, it's about a um, Venus flytrap style plant that grows and causes a whole bunch of havoc. So these are my pickups for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please remember to like and subscribe. And as always, have a blessed day, everybody.